In this triad exercise, we're asked to classify the equation as a conditional equation, an identity, or a contradiction equation. Uh, how we do that is, if it's conditional, we'll end up with one solution. If it's an identity, that means it's all real numbers, uh, and we'd end up with the variable falls out, and we end up with a true statement, so this number equals the same number. And if it's a contradiction, then we'll end up with the variable falling out and an untrue statement. Uh, this number equals a different number. So the process is the same initially as just solving the equation. So we'll go ahead and simplify by distributing on both sides. So 4 plus 9 times 3 is 27x. 9 times negative 7, that's minus 63 equals negative 42x minus 13 plus 23 times 3 that's going to be 69x and then 23 times negative 2 that's minus 46 so then we combine like terms we have 27x 4 minus 63 that's minus 59 equals negative 42x plus 69x that equals 27x and then minus 13 minus 46 is minus 59 so we can already see that the the variable is going to fall out and we're going to end up with uh, the same value on both sides if we subtract 27x from both sides we end up with negative 59 equals negative 59 so this is an identity equation and the solution is all real numbers and what that means is that it doesn't matter what value we substitute in we're always going to end up with a, a true statement so like if we put in x equals 1 we would have 4 plus 9 times 3 times 1 minus 7 equals negative 42 times 1 minus 13 plus 23 times 3 times 1 minus 2 if we simplify that working from the inside out 4 plus 9 times 3 minus 7 is negative 4 equals negative 42 minus 13 plus 23 3 times 1 is 3 minus 2 is 1 so this would be 4 minus 36 and this ends up being well if we have negative 42 minus 13 that's negative 55 plus 23 4 minus 36 is negative 32 negative 55 plus 23 again is negative 32 and it doesn't matter what value if we used x equals 2 x equals 3 x equals 1.8756 it doesn't matter what value we plug in for x this will always be a true statement and that's why it's an identity and the solution is all real numbers